In this video we will review how to add a new issue from the BCF manager in your BIM modeling software, like Archicad, Revit, Tecla, and other. Once you are connected to the project, and have your model loaded, start by creating a 3D view in your model that best captures the issue in question by using the section box. To add a new issue, click on the plus icon. When creating a new issue, a 3D viewpoint and an image snapshot of the current view will be saved. The 3D viewpoint can be opened in any BIM modeling software, while the image snapshot is the title image of the issue, and is useful for working in softwares without the modeling environment, like the BIM Collab web application. When creating a new issue through the BCF Manager, you will be able to choose which components will be stored in the viewpoint from the issue dialog. All components that are visible on your screen at the moment of creating the issue will be visible in the snapshot, but only the chosen components will be linked to the viewpoints and show up in the list of IFC GUIDs. To add 2D annotations to your view, click on the pencil icon next to the snapshot. The image will open in the editing program of your choice, where you can add text and shapes to share additional information with your team. Now, let's move on to the information and properties that can be added about a new issue. First, add a title to your issue, and use the description tab to add more detailed information. Use the fields in the top section to assign the most important properties to the issues in your project, like milestone, priority and more. Most of the fields have predefined values, meaning they can be selected from the drop-down menu. These values can be added and edited at any time by the project leader in the settings tab of the BIM Collab web application. Another important field is, who will be responsible for this issue. You can assign a team member, from the list of team members previously added in the BIM Collab web app, who will be responsible for the next step of issue resolution. If needed, you can also select multiple teammates to be notified by email of this issue's creation or edits made. The notify field is used only for the current action, and will not be saved for future edits of the same issue, so make sure the users are added again to the notify field next time an issue is updated. Connected and Enterprise Plan offer additional features, like Approval Person and Custom and Visibility fields. In the Approval field, you can assign one or more team members who are responsible for approving or rejecting the resolution of the issue, before closing it. Custom fields are used to add additional information. The first two custom fields are list-based, and the other two custom fields are text-based, where users can type free text information. The suggested titles are example titles, but you can set up your own custom field and value naming. The visibility field is used to define which team members can view the issue. Through groups, which are assigned to users in BIM Collab's Team Members tab, you can manage who the issue will be visible for. Select any of the created groups, and the issue will only be visible for members of that group. On to the Comments field, where you can add additional notes and information. For the most efficient workflow, it is important to log in any actions that took place by creating a clear comment in the issue. This way you can document any of the issue changes, including updated information, change of the assigned user, or status of the issue. Once you have added all the necessary information, click Save in the bottom right corner. If you wish to remove an issue, click the minus icon, as long as the issue has not yet been synchronized to BIM Collab. Once issues have been synchronized to BIM Collab, it is not possible to delete them, to ensure a full audit trail that keeps track of all the changes. Remember to click on the synchronization button when you have finished your work. This way you will minimize communication conflicts between team members working on the same issues. Now that you've learned how to add issues from the BCF Manager, watch the next video to learn more about the BIM Collab workflow.